All right, tell me your name. Andre. Andre, and what do you do? Your shirt here says something about what you do. So, um, I'm a tour guide for Taste Porto's food tour. I'm also a civil engineer, but today I'm here to present you Taste Porto. Uh, we, we have this uh, food tour of Porto, a three and a half hour tour. And in those, in those three and a half hours, I'll have you taste a little bit of Porto's history, architecture, culture, and food, obviously. And that was actually, I, we just finished the tour, and you really do a good job of bringing those together. Because some of the buildings have architectural importance. Exactly. And some of the foods, you know, have historical purpose or other things like that. So, um, what, this is a new company. Why did you decide to become a tour guide? Uh, well, as well as my partners, I share a big passion for food, travel, and Porto. And we kind of thought that um, when traveling, if you have uh, a local experience, when you get, a, get to know someone who lives in that city, you get a much uh, you know, richer experience, a more unique one. Uh, you really get in touch with that city's culture. So that's why we want to give that experience to someone, that emotional experience to someone who visits Port. So I, I had a great time. It was delicious. Um, I discovered a few things that I hadn't seen, which, yeah. you know, there's still a lot to discover here, exactly. a lot to go. But I, I asked you this earlier, but um, when people come here, they think sardines, francesinhas, chorizo, and the ports, of course. What are the what are the couple things that people always forget to ask for? Okay, starting with the more obvious one, I would say a data. People don't, they do tend to miss it, overlook it. Uh, but then there's the uh, the uh, rye cornbread, which is Mbroa da Vinci. Also the uh, termosos, which are huge. People, uh, well, at the end of the day, when I have when I chill out with my friends, having a, a beer, there's the muscles on the table, always. So yeah, the, that's a small diamond, a small hidden gem of Porto. And what are they? Uh, they're like this, uh, I would say, small lentil yellow things. Uh, they're related to beans and lentils. They're in the same family, so uh, they're like that. I don't know really to explain it to you. You have to taste it. Yeah, they're a snack food. Yeah, they're, yeah, exactly. They're a snack food and very nutritious also. Yeah, so, uh, so far, is, are things going well? Yeah, things are going well. We're just starting. Yeah. Uh, we started May 1st, but yeah, things are going well. People are enjoying our tours, and that's what we want to do. We want to give this emotional experience so that our customers, at the end of the tour, are our friends, actually. So that's our goal. Well, you're doing a good job so far, so keep it up. Thank you so much. <laughs> Cheers.